Welcome to Vlog Reviews Your Channels. If you're one of the channels involved in this video and you don't want to wait around, click on your part of the video now. Otherwise, stick around and watch the video and make sure to support all the channels involved. Thank you. Number 1 Hello everybody and welcome back to Vlog Reviews your channels. Yes, that's right. I am back with another one, and I'm going to keep doing these as long as I have three to continue to do them with. Uh, and, of course, the contest will continue to run as the three, uh, or as the two videos a week continues. So we're uh, getting toward the end of the month. So uh, I believe that this week... Okay, I'm going to pull up my map. Uh, so uh, there's going to be one more week. And then next week, or and then the week after that, um, I probably won't do videos. I'll do my uh, five channels that I've picked. And then you guys are going to vote. And then whoever wins, I'm going to get in contact with. And we're going to discuss which game you would like. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to start off with... Cut here, DJ. Now, anybody who knows my earlier stuff knows that I had a huge problem pronouncing this guy's name, uh, and that's kind of how we became friends. And uh, it's it's just kind of funny because I tried saying everything. I was like Cuth here or uh, Cuthher DJ and all kinds of stuff like that. I was just saying all kinds of random stuff that didn't make sense. And then finally, I figured out that it's just Cut Here DJ, and it was because I watched one of his videos, and he and he said it. Uh, he said it a little fast, and so I didn't quite hear it at first. And then I, when I went back, my mind was like, "Why didn't you figure that out to begin with? That's stupid." But that's kind of how we became friends and everything. And he's a really cool guy, and he wanted me to review his channel, so. Here I am reviewing Cut Here DJ's channel. Now, uh, I went ahead and unsubscribed like I always do because I'm looking for a channel trailer, and that's one of the big things that I always look for. So, um, and when I unsubscribed and went back to his main page, he does not have a channel trailer. Bad, bad Cut Here DJ. Uh, <laughs> not really. Um, uh, I, I, I see this a lot for some reason. I don't. Uh, it, it, I think it's just because um, the uh, intro or um, channel trailer thing is sort of new, and it's sort of a new idea and stuff like that. And so, not a lot of people have gotten around to do it, or they've been really busy, or people's work schedules don't work and stuff like that. And I, I understand that. So, uh, but 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 the first thing that I notice is that you should probably make a channel trailer because that allows you to, in your own words, describe what your channel is, what people are going to find here, and what they should expect to find here in the future. And uh, it really helps people, like I keep saying, hit this subscribe button just a little more because, like, I mean, if you look at my intro video, it's really goofy and weird, but I also, you know, get the ability to introduce myself, Daijiling, and everything that we do on the channel, and uh, people really responded to it, and people seem to really like it a lot, and... It's one of the most commented on things that we've got on our channel and stuff like that because it's the first thing people see if they don't uh, if they're not subscribed already. So it's always really cool to see. Uh, if you need help setting that up, I can definitely help you out. Uh, I don't think you'll probably need my help because you seem to be you seem to have everything down pretty well. Because as I scrolled down, I saw that you have a list of all your let's plays in your playlists and stuff like that which is really cool go away I'm fast um but, but uh, uh i see that you've got a lot of that stuff down there so like if i wanted to go and watch the eldritch series that you've got which is really cool and i love that game uh i recorded a couple of episodes and then kind of abandoned it and i feel kind of bad and i might return because with uh, October coming up and stuff like that, we're gonna, I'm going to be playing a lot more horror games. And I know it's cliche, but I love horror games, and I haven't gotten around to playing a lot of them. And I, and I just made a brand new intro, which you guys should see on one of our new videos and stuff like that. So, um, 
uh, well, I didn't make it, but I uh, I followed a template and everything. So you guys will see it. It's pretty cool. Um, uh, but anyway, you have all the Let's Play stuff that you've been doing, and that's awesome. Um, and you also have your collab thing, and I really should get together with you and do a collab at some point in time so that you can add me to that list and do some stuff there. That'd be awesome. We just got to figure out which game to play and stuff like that, so yeah. Uh, anyway, um, you got your live stream stuff, which I also am starting to get into. Uh, the first live stream I did was kind of rocky, but I figured out why. It was because somebody else was doing something on the internet and it kind of screwed everything up. But also you've got your popular uploads, which allows people to come to your channel and be like, well, what made people want to stick around? And apparently your Xenonaut stuff is something that really made people want to stick around. Um, and some of your Mountain Blade stuff. And of course your ALS Ice Bucket Challenge. I wonder who challenged you to that? Oh yeah, it was me. Um, <laughs> but you also have other great channels. And you have us listed. And uh, like I always say, I never ask people to do that. And that's really, really cool. Thank you very much, Cut Here DJ. Uh, like I said, you know, he's, he's a big uh, proponent. And he helped us out a lot. And he continues to help us out because he's a really cool guy. So you guys should definitely check him out. But we're going to go to the About section. And we see that his name is Cut Here DJ. Uh, his channel is a mixture of uh, random gaming. See, like, if you basically take your about section and you record a video of either, uh, like, yourself, um, uh, like a face cam thing, or you could put together, like, a clip show and show people what you're doing and stuff like that, and that's awesome. Uh, so... Uh, yeah, yeah, I mean, basically, if you take your about section and you put it on a video... That's all you need to do, because there's a lot of stuff here. You even have your schedule, so you have like two videos every Saturday, and stuff like that, and all kinds of other stuff. So it's really, really cool to see that you've got all this stuff. You've got aims and goals, and you got a disclaimer and stuff like that, which I think I need to put down too. So... Now I know that you've got like 52 views or something like that, and... Uh, or no, not 52 views. <laughs> 52 subscribers you got over a thousand views but you've got 52 subscribers and for what you do i honestly believe that you you deserve a lot more than that because you do a lot of really quality content you really uh entertain people and stuff like that you've entertained me on numerous occasions when i've watched your videos so i definitely think that you deserve more subscribers and you also, uh, I mean, I know that you're grateful for every one of your subscribers, and that's really cool. But, I mean, everybody go give him some love, watch some of his videos, and make sure that you comment on him and stuff like that. That way he kind of can, you know, get some, you know, yeah. <laughs> so basically, yeah. But uh, down here at the bottom, he's got his Twitch, Facebook, he's got a game giveaway thing, he's got uh, Get Cheap Games donate uh, he's got literally everything down here he's got a spread shirt thing uh he actually made a t-shirt uh based around the idea that i couldn't pronounce his name and he showed it to me and i bought one and uh i i haven't gotten it yet because i kind of forgot about it but then i went back and bought one so you guys will probably see pictures or a video of me wearing it at some point in time but also, we're coming out with our own t-shirts here soon, so you guys should definitely watch for that. It's gonna, uh, basically, anytime you get a t-shirt from us, uh, if you don't like donating to charities, uh, if you, every time you give us money for a t-shirt, we're gonna donate it to the charity that we're doing a fundraiser for right now. And then after that fundraiser is over, um, we'll still uh, sell the t-shirts and stuff like that and then we'll probably do another fundraiser at some point in the future and just kind of do the same thing so uh, definitely uh, definitely be looking forward to that but see up here on your banner you also have all the stuff that you need up here you have your spread shirt Facebook Twitter and all that stuff uh, definitely when you uh, check out Cut Here DJ definitely add him on Twitter because he does shout outs and stuff like that and he'll shout you out and you know you guys can become friends like us and now you know how to pronounce his name before I did so yeah there's the thing um, anyway I love your banner uh, I've always I've always loved your banner 
Uh, and every time I see the uh, Union Jack, I uh, continuously think now, for some reason, cut here DJ. And I don't even think England. I don't know why. It's just like, for some reason, my brain, every, ever since I tried to learn how to pronounce your name, and I saw that over and over again, now every time I see that, I'm like, cut here DJ? Uh, but I definitely love your your banner. Your banner's really cool. It's it's really simple, uh, and that's exactly what you need. Is you just need something simple that is just really really cool looking. Uh, you also have your uh, avatar, which is always awesome. And the scissors should have been a dead giveaway to your name again, but I'm not gonna dwell on that. Anymore. Uh, but anyway, uh, we'll, we'll just kind of move on past that. Uh, but like I said, I love your banner. I love your avatar and your channel is just really, really, really cool. He does really good quality content and everything. And, uh, and he, he hasn't uh, done anything for about a week, but I think it's because he said he was on vacation and stuff like that. So that's really, really cool that, um, uh, that, that he's able to go on it for some reason I haven't gone on a vacation for a little while I think I need to go on a vacation from work but I think that's coming up here in October at the end of October and beginning of November when we're going to the Ohio World Comic Con in Columbus so if for any reason you're in Ohio and the last day of October in the first two days of November and you happen to be up around the Columbus area we will be there and if you want to meet us, I mean, we're not really big YouTubers or anything like that, but if you want to meet us, we'll definitely say hi to you and stuff. You should know me by my mustache. Uh, so there you go. But anyway, uh, cut here, DJ. The only thing that I can see that you really need to do is uh, to make up a channel trailer and stuff like that. Other than that, you've got a really solid channel, and I, I really believe you deserve a lot more subscribers than you have. Uh, so this is almost more of a shout out and just a couple of little things here and there your your uh, your thumbnails are really really cool uh, your yeah I mean like literally everything is really really cool and I really enjoy your stuff and I think people would too he's got a lot of kind of random stuff uh, and so that makes there's a lot of variety there's a lot of variety in his channel so uh, you definitely will be able to find something that you like and you'll definitely be able to jump in and just watch his stuff and just enjoy what he's doing so uh, definitely check him out uh, give him a sub you know comment to his stuff watch his stuff and yeah I think that everything should go well for cut here DJ so thank you once again cut here DJ for being part of this uh, episode and we will go ahead and move on to the next channel in this episode. Number two. All right, and the next channel that we're going to, uh, that I'm going to be doing a review for is another person that I met on uh, Freedom, I believe, and uh, we got to know each other pretty well, and he's a really, really, really cool guy. He's got a lot of unique stuff that happens on his channel. Uh, which also goes along with the name of his channel and he's done a lot of improvements as of recent that I can see and that's really really cool um, he got in contact with me and uh, he was on the list already and he was all the way up at the top of the list and then he said I think my channel is ready and um, I was like well I, I will probably won't have to wait that long much longer and that was because literally he was in the next batch so um, we're going to go ahead and do a review of Airbrusher Games and Art. Now this guy is really, really, really cool. And uh, I, I just want to mention what he does real fast before I jump into most of the channel trailer stuff. But he does not only do uh, gaming and stuff like that, but he also has a series of airbrush art. And it's really, really good. Um, like, like the airbrush pencils and stuff like that like I'm not an artist and so I'm easily impressed but uh, Daijiling took a look at some of his stuff and she's kind of more the artist and stuff and she said that it looked really really cool uh, airbrushing is kind of hard uh, I can tell by you know just 
the people who are able to do it really well. It takes a lot of work to do some of the stuff that they do. And this guy, he's really, really good at what he does. Um, but I, I definitely enjoy watching not only his gaming stuff, but also his airbrush art stuff. So it's definitely awesome to see uh, something a little different from a channel. Uh, it, it, and yeah, I mean, definitely check out his airbrush stuff as well as his gaming stuff when you check his channel out because it's awesome. Um, but I unsubscribed like usual and then I went back and he's got a channel trailer. He uploaded it about a week ago, so he's probably preparing for me to do this. And I don't mind that at all because if, if you know that you're on the list and you preemptively make a video like that or something, that's awesome. So uh, I watched your channel trailer and everything, and it's it's fine. And uh, you did like um, you showed a lot of clips and stuff like that, and you showed like some of your airbrush stuff, and that's pretty much all you have to do. Like you don't really have to talk too much. Um, if you do talk, you can explain things a little bit more. But uh, other than that, your channel trailer is fine. If you want to add words to it later or something like that, it's definitely something that I would do. But other than that, you're fine because, uh, you know, when people watch it, you know, they get to tap their foot to an awesome beat while also watching you play awesome games and do some of your airbrush stuff, which is always cool. Um, other than that, uh, it's definitely going to help help hit help people hit the subscribe button a little bit more. I noticed that it's got like 86 views, but you only have 25 subs, and that's just a shame. Because you have a really unique channel, and I really think that you deserve a lot more than that. But I know that you're very, very grateful to the people that you, uh, that you, that subscribe to you, that follow you on Twitter and stuff like that, because I'm one of those people and I've noticed that, and you're a really kind person and it really shows on everything that you do. And it's really cool. Um, uh, but anyway, we got your, you have created playlists down here. So you play star citizen, which is really, really, it's a really cool game. I haven't gotten into it as much as I want to, but I did buy it. And I kind of bought it because of the fact that uh, you were playing it and I watched some of your videos. So I'm definitely going to have to break into that a little bit more. Um, uh, then you've got some World of Tanks and you've got some... Well, okay, I didn't really want to click on that. But there you go, the Zen of Star Citizen. But, uh, but uh, yeah, basically you've got some War Thunder. you got a lot of War Thunder and that actually is something that me and you might have to get into together at some point. Or world of tanks because i i just recently started getting into world of tanks a little bit more so i'm really poor right now but i i i will get better i promise uh there is one thing that i noticed about your thumbnails and uh everything but i think what you're doing with it is you're kind of going with the airbrush thing and uh every time you make a thumbnail you seem to write it in kind of an airbrush style and that's really cool other than that like um your thumbnails, uh, some of your thumbnails don't have words on it and stuff like that. Some of them are just pictures from a video. I would definitely, uh, I, I, I don't know how many there are, so if there's a lot of them, I wouldn't go back and like do all of them. But from now on, just make sure that every video that you release has a really cool thumbnail and stuff. And it looks like you've done that already and stuff so that's really really cool uh you are getting a lot uh, or you're getting a lot more views on your star citizen stuff and that's really cool because star citizen is a fantastic game if you're into uh space stuff it's definitely your kind of game definitely check out star citizen at some point because it's pretty cool um You've got a list of uploads, you've got your created playlist, like I said, you've got your popular uploads, which allow people to see what you did, what, what's, uh, what's brought people to your channel and kept them around, and like I said, it's mostly Star Citizen stuff, um, and everything else. You've got, a, you've got a nice setup here, and I really like that. Um, you have your featured channels off to the side. Once again, I see me there, and I very much appreciate it. I appreciate everybody who does something like that, because I never ask them to. I never go around and say, hey, will you add me to your featured channels? Somebody always comes up to me, and they'll be like, can we add you to our featured channels and stuff? And then I always respond in kind. I always add you to my featured channels as well. 
and I always appreciate it, like I said. Uh, but uh, we'll go ahead and we'll move on to your about section because featured channels is a really cool way to help your friends, anything that you're a fan of, try to get more subscribers, more views, and stuff like that as well. So he uh, he has his about section here, and he uh, basically says what I said. You know, he he's an artist and a gamer, two things that you wouldn't think would coexist. Take a look, and you'll be surprised, and you would be surprised because it's really cool stuff. And definitely check that out. I've already rambled on about it, but I'm still gonna say it. It's really cool. Uh, you have your business inquiries email, which is always a good idea. Uh, you got Twitter, Facebook, and Google Plus down there. And you've got your Twitter and Google Plus up there in your banner. You might want to put your Facebook up there too. That way people can go and follow you on Facebook and stuff like that as well. But that's definitely a good thing right there. Also, um, really, really like your... Oh, I thought I heard something. Really, really like your... Um, your banner and everything it looks really really cool uh i like the airbrush pattern in the background and then you've just got airbrush pins and your name that's actually just a really really cool looking background i don't know if you made it but if you did that's awesome because i can't make a banner to save my life <laughs> but that is awesome um your avatar is just a picture of you doing airbrush stuff and that's awesome as well um, like I said, your avatar can be anything related to you, anything related to anything that you do. And uh, it's just another little piece of art that people can be like, well, hey, I recognize that. That's, you know, somebody. And then they'll start knowing you by name and stuff like that. And that's always really cool. But um, essentially, um, you know, he's a really inspirational type guy. If you watch his airbrush stuff, it really should inspire you to kind of want to do art better. It kind of does that to me, but of course the fact is is that I can't do art for some reason. My hand is basically uh, like, I don't want to do art. Instead, I want to draw stick figures and make things look stupid. And that's basically what happens when I touch anything that will allow me to draw. But uh, but basically, we'll go back to your main page, like, I, like right now, and uh, I will say that you have a channel trailer. Um, if you ever want to edit it, the only thing that I would add is like you describing what you do on the channel, either in words or in words on the screen. Um, uh, you, you, I, I kind of thought of a really cool idea that I'll just throw out there. You don't have to do it. It's just like a little thing that I, for some reason, thought of. Like, you could airbrush. Uh, it would probably take a hell of a long time, and I really don't want to, like, mention this and then have you go doing it and stuff like that, and then, you know. But uh, you could, like, airbrush kind of... Um, like the words of what you do and stuff like that and then like have it appearing on the screen in like a speed art type style but i like i said that might take a long time and i hate i hate all i hate suggesting things to artists that do really cool stuff because uh i never realize how long it can take to do these things because i'm not an artist and then i and then i always feel really bad when it's taken them a while to do something and then they show it to me and it's always awesome but i feel really bad because i made them take time out of their busy schedules to do something so if you want to do it you, you can but if you don't want to do it just ignore that comment completely but um, it's a it, you got a really really cool channel. You're playing some really cool games that not a lot of people are playing. There's not a lot of World of Tanks. There's not a lot of War Thunder, and there's a little bit more Star Citizen and stuff. But I think it's because that's just a little bit more of a mainstream game. But uh, definitely check out Airbrusher Games and Art because he's a really cool guy. I know I'm gonna have to jump into some games with Airbrusher at some point in time so that you guys can meet him more on my channel and and uh and then check out his channel more if you're not checking it out like you should be right now so definitely go and check him out watch his stuff give him some comments and some advice if you've got any advice to give him and stuff like that and definitely uh subscribe to his channel because he's got a really cool stuff and you guys will definitely enjoy it whether you're a fan of art or whether you're a fan of games and stuff like that so definitely check it out but thank you very much airbrusher for being a part of this episode and we will move on to the next champ number three all 
right, and the last channel that we're going to go ahead and do is a channel that I believe got in contact with me through some means. I don't really remember which means. And really, like, if I forget what means that you got in contact with me, uh, I really am sorry, but, like, I, I get a lot of requests through different forums and stuff like that and through just random comments on the videos and uh, this might have been one of the first comments on one of the first videos and I apologize for it taking so long and everything but uh, you definitely um, uh, it's it's I hope hope well worth the wait so uh, right now we're gonna do uh, sky tunes ng now this is a gaming comedy and more obviously by his banner and stuff like that now I unsubscribed <clears throat> so that I could check out if he's got a channel trailer and he does not so what I'm going to say right off the bat is you should definitely create a channel trailer for your channel so that people know exactly what they're getting into when they come to your channel so that way they hit that subscribe button right there just a little bit more um, or a little bit faster I guess they could click it more but it wouldn't really do anything it would just unsubscribe and resubscribe to you over and over again but anyway <laughs> we'll just go ahead and move past my little faux pas. Um, anyway, um, like I said, make a little channel introduction for your channel. Uh, just, you know, kind of explain what you do. It's mostly Minecraft stuff, but, you know, just kind of set up, like, what you do so people can be like, oh, well, that actually sounds pretty interesting to me. I'll go ahead and subscribe to him. Maybe we can get together at some point down the road and do like a collab or something like that. You know, something like that. But um, but yeah, essentially, um, he does uh, mostly Minecraft stuff. But uh, I love, like I said, all the time. I love Minecraft because uh, you know you can watch a bunch of different Minecraft videos, and each one's different because everybody does something a little different from something that they're doing that somebody else wouldn't have done. And uh, I really enjoy watching it because there's a lot of creativity, a lot of unique people uh, here and there with, uh, with Minecraft and other games like that as well. Basically anything where you build, there's always the ability to have something really unique that nobody else has. And I really always love that idea. I love the idea of using your imagination and getting out there and being like, this is what I'm doing, uh, you know, I'm going to build this, and then even if it turns out really crappy, you built that. And that's what I love. I love Minecraft like that, and that's the reason. Uh, I just redid our server, so I'm going to have to jump in and maybe record some stuff with some people in our server. Uh, it's a whitelisted server, so I might, I might be inviting people, you know, here and there, and... Uh, doing some stuff with them. I might do some, uh, I was going to do a 500 subscriber thing, but we're nearing 600 already. And I don't know how that's possible. My mind is blown by the amount of growth that our channel has gotten. Uh, we've got some inactive subs and stuff like that. We don't have a lot of views for a lot of our videos. And I know that that's a problem with a lot of channels and stuff like that. So I'm trying to keep people entertained. I'm trying to keep people involved and stuff like that. And hopefully I can pull these inactive subscribers into the activeness of the community. But um, anyway, uh, I see that you've got your uploads there. You've got some uh, playlists and stuff like that. I see that you're doing faction stuff, but you only have two videos in the faction series playlist. So definitely remember to get these uh, other two videos into this so that way if people want to just check out your faction stuff they can click on that and be like oh okay well now i can watch all of his faction videos and stuff like that instead of having to click on each one so definitely do that uh and keep doing that as you upload videos make sure they you put them in like things also you've got some popular upload stuff which is also cool um so people can definitely come to your channel and be like, well, what made people stick around with this guy? And this is exactly what it is. Um, but pretty much it looks really cool. Uh, your thumbnails are really nicely done and everything. They're really nice and colorful and they'll make people want to click on them just a little bit more. Minecraft has a lot of, you get a lot of ability to make really cool thumbnails with Minecraft stuff as well. And that's what I always like to see is really colorful and nicely done Minecraft things. So, um, let's see, we'll move on to your about section. Oh yeah, you've also got some awesome people stuff off to the side where you're helping out people that you might know 
uh, or you might just be fans of, and that's always a really good idea. I always recommend that because it helps your friends, it helps people that you're a fan of do uh, or uh, get more subscribers, get more views and everything. It really helps out. But uh, anyway, in his about section, he tells you who he is and what he does. And uh, he has a name for his fans called the Toon Squad and stuff like that, which is always really cool. Uh, you've gone over 300 subscribers, so you're about 350. You're rounding 400, so you're doing really, really well for yourself. Um, and I still think that you deserve more. Uh, as time goes on, you'll probably end up getting a lot more, and that's really, really cool. Uh, you have your Twitter, Google+, and Twitch down here. You have Twitter and Google+, in your banner. I would definitely add your Twitch up there so that people can see that you've got a Twitch, and then they can go there and be like, ooh, okay, well, let's see what if he's live streaming right now. Also, um, if you live stream, not scream, if you live stream on like a regular basis, make sure that you put up your schedule somewhere so that people can be like, oh, well, he's going to be on Twitch here and then make sure that you are around the time that you're supposed to be and then always be on there and people will come and watch and become fans of you and stuff like that. I know I'm starting to get into Twitch, but like I said, I'm an old man trying to learn new tricks and it's a little hard sometimes. But um, yeah, uh, basically your channel introduction, your channel trailer could almost just be this, just a little bit more fleshed out and that's pretty much all you need to do. Uh, and then like show a clip show or you can do a face cam if you really want to. You haven't done a face reveal, so if you want to do a face cam, that would also be a face reveal. But you don't have to. People do not have to do that. Um, if you're uncomfortable being on camera, um, you don't really have to do a face cam, especially for your channel trailer. If you want to wait and do that later, you can. People always like to see who's behind the channels and stuff like that. It took a little while for me to get Daijiling to do it, uh, but once she did it, she realized that people, you know, they're, they're, she thought that people would judge her more harshly, and they didn't, and I'm very glad of that, so that's really cool. But um, I love your banner. Your banner's really simplistic and stuff like that. Um, since you do a lot of Minecraft stuff, you might want to add some Minecraft to your banner so that that way people can be like, oh, well, you know, because uh, when I first heard your name, I thought that you did that Toontown stuff. Uh, uh, Toontown Reborn or whatever that game is. Um, and so when I came to your channel and saw that you do a lot of Minecraft stuff, I got really confused for a second. And then I realized, oh wait, that's just his thing. So um, definitely if you do anything to your banner or your avatar, you can add like a little Minecraft thing here and there. Like make the sun you know, basically the Minecraft sun, and that's pretty much all you gotta do. Um, other than that, uh, you gotta really, it's simplistic, but it's really cool, and it has your name in it and everything, and that's fine, and your uh, avatar is about the same way. You don't have to do much. All you gotta do is do something really simplistic like this, and that's all you gotta do. But, like I said, I would definitely add something Minecraft in your banner and your avatar so that that way people can be like, oh, okay, well, that's related to his Minecraft stuff, and he does mostly Minecraft. Because one of the first things people see, aside from your channel trailer, is the art for your banner. And so if they see something like that, they might get confused like me. Or maybe I'm just really easily confused for no reason because I'm old. <sighs> but, <laughs> but anyway, um, like I said... Uh, definitely make a channel introduction so that people can uh, see what you do in your own words and uh, they'll hit that subscribe button a little bit faster. Even though you got 350 subscribers, I can guarantee you that you'll get some more if you make a uh, channel trailer and stuff like that because it's always a cool thing to see. Uh, you can modify your banner and add a little bit of Minecraft stuff to it since you do mostly Minecraft stuff. Uh, and that that's just a bit of advice and I would definitely add your Twitch in your banner so that people can go and visit that and if you've got a if you've got a regular schedule for twitch make sure that you put that somewhere on your channel as well you can actually put that in your introduction video if you really want to and then people will you know go and see what you're doing on twitch during the times where you're supposed to be there uh, other than that you've got a really solid channel I really enjoy your minecraft videos and I just keep doing what you're doing Definitely check out Skytunes NG because he's a really cool uh, guy and he really deserves probably more subs than he's got. I think so. I believe so. So definitely go and watch his stuff. You know, give him some comments, give him some love, and uh, you know, you can tell him 
Tell them Flog sent you. You can tell them Flog sent you on any of the channels. Pretty much. Because I'm awesome in every way. No? Okay. Anyway, we'll, we'll go ahead and we'll uh, call it here for this episode of Flog Reviews Your Channels. So remember, check out all the channels that are involved in this video. And also click that like button and comment if you want your channel reviewed. And I haven't already told you that you're added to the list. Uh, definitely comment and say, hey, I want my channel reviewed. And I will add you to the list. That's as simple as that. You don't even have to be subscribed. You know, I mean, I appreciate every subscriber that I get. But if you want me to review your channel and you don't want to subscribe because you don't like what we're doing, uh, it doesn't really matter to me because I will definitely review your channel whether or not you're subscribed to me. And I will definitely, uh, if I like what I see, I will definitely subscribe to you as well. Um, and it doesn't have to just be gaming. If you do a vlog channel, if you do a movie, re if you do review channel, if you do... You know, whatever you do, I will definitely take a look at it and I will definitely review your channel for you if that is what you wish. So, uh, once again, like I always say, this is just an advice section. You don't have to take what I say and do anything with it, but I always like to give helpful advice. This is my way of paying back a community that has helped us out greatly. And I definitely appreciate it with everything that is me. And thank you very much for everything that you guys have done for us the growth for our channel, and the views for our channel. Thank you very, very much. But anyway, we'll go ahead and call it there. Remember to click that like button, comment, and subscribe if you want. And also, um, de definitely check out our fundraiser for the Brain and Behavior Research Foundation. We're designing t-shirts right now that we're giving away for anybody who spends over $20. Uh, we'll start selling those t-shirts here soon, and in the, any t-shirt that you buy in the uh, month of October will go directly to the Brain and Behavior Research Foundation. It'll come to us. We'll uh, either write them a check or donate directly to their website. But other than that, we will see you guys in another video. Goodbye, everybody. Thank you very much for watching that video. Click in the upper left to subscribe and then check out Unturned. I need pants. I don't have any pants. <laughs> check us out on Google Plus and Twitter for all the new updates for the channel. And then check out Five Nights at Freddy's. Um... Also, make sure you click on the Brain and Behavior logo there so you can check out the charity drive that we're doing for them right now. Also, thank you very much, and goodbye, everyone.